part about coming to this event? Well, I would have to say the easiest part of it, it's the people. I mean, you come to this town, a small town America. Uh, I mean, when you have people thank you for coming to their town, it, it says a lot about the people. My name is uh, Jim Real. I'm the uh, CEO of Jim Real Friendly Automotive Group, along with Unreal Marine and Unreal Performance. We're sponsoring for the seventh year in a row the Thursday Fun Run from Boyne City to Bay Harbor. We're very thankful that we can do this, and thank God the weather's nice. <laughs> I'm Mike Knobloch from American Custom Marine. We're the uh, Nortec dealer and Donzi dealer for the Great Lakes. We do the Thursday night welcome party. We've been doing it for about 10 years now and it just kind of gets everybody together before the event. They can talk boats and do a little relaxing. Downtown can get quite hectic, and I'm sure you might get some shots of the stroll of the streets tonight, and it's not unusual for there to be 10,000 people downtown. doing here tonight is actually we're combining two of our most iconic events that's our stroll the streets that happens for 13 weeks on Friday nights every summer and uh, we're combining that with our Boyne Thunder so we have our Boyne Thunder night and our stroll the street nights they converge and this becomes probably Boyne City's biggest summer evening of the year We have probably around 60 boats in our little downtown marina uh, that start up all at once um, after the playing of the national anthem. And the um, thunder that is created by that startup is, is simply amazing. take off to circle around, um, you'll understand why we call this Boyne Thunder.
50 or 60 boats that idle out of the marina, each one with a beautiful paint job, each one with a different kind of engine, each one with a different kind of hull, um, and it is simply art on display as it floats across the water. The only way out of Lake Charlevoix is through um, what we call the Pine River, a rather narrow channel that runs through Round Lake in Charlevoix. Round Lake and the channel on either side of that and Pine River are just packed with boats, both in the water and out in Lake Michigan, and spectators. On the other side of Charlevoix, once folks get under the bridge, Lake Michigan is about four boat lengths away. And when they get a, just about a half a mile away from that Pine River, they're allowed to open up. And so uh, they take that mile out and make a big sweeping turn off to the left um, to hit the first card stop down in Elk Rapids. There's no speed limit on Lake Michigan tomorrow for them. Everybody in this town is so welcoming, warm, appreciative. It's just a wonderful place to be, and the town itself, come on, it just doesn't get better. Northern Michigan's fantastic.
What is your favorite part about coming here for this event? Oh, the community in Boyne City, hands down. The water is crystal clear. The kids camp that benefits from this event is second to, it's just, it's a fantastic group of people. They raise a ton of money for a great cause. And of course you can't beat the water. Roll with me, take you for a ride. Just come and see, take a look inside. Yeah, it's all you need, it's gonna be the vibe. Cruising through the sky, yeah, we feeling all right. Take a leap, throw a little smile, jump in the seat. Play pretend, go have a night on the town. Just lighten up, put on a smile. We live it up, just let me know if you're down, down. Hey, I'm jumping in, I dropped the pin, I'm on the way. Might not get there right on time, I'm never late. No. At the party, I just came to show my face. Now it's time to hit the road and get away. Hey, over me, take you for a ride. Hey, just come and see. People come back time and time again. They're surprised by what they find here. They find the community very welcoming. And that's a great place to have a good time.